Sam going to find that particular right ray which has came out. With the help of that, I am going to find the angle of deviation. Now I am going to remove all these prism and pins carefully. So wherever the pins dipped, we need to draw a line joining these two pins, C and D. You know these two pins names are C and D. Drawing these two pins along with the line which marked at the on from on to the surface which is PR that I am going to take that point as M. Okay. So now I am going to complete the figure. So in this we need to join the M and N points. So making the arrow mark clearly. Here A B A, B are the two pins which will dip inside, which gives you the incident ray and M, N gives you the refracted ray. N, C, D gives you the emergent ray. N, C, D gives you the emergent ray. We have already calculated angle of incidence is 50 degrees. Now we need to draw a normal at the point N. We need to draw a normal at the point N. Normal already we know perpendicular line at point N for PR. Now we need to calculate the angle of angle of deviation. Sorry, angle of emergent. Angle of emergent. With the help of 90 degrees which coincides with the PR, 0 degrees coincides with the normal. So the angle of emergent, we found it as 50 degrees approximately. Angle of emergence, we found it as 50 degrees. So, angle of emergence is also 50 degrees. Angle of emergence is also 50 degrees. That shows clearly the deviation is minimum. The deviation is minimum. So, in these particular values, with these particular values, we have to, to find the deviation. Angle of deviation. We need to extend the incident ray. We need to extend the emergent ray also. We need to extend the emergent ray. Where these two rays meet, that is the angle of deviation. The angle of deviation is nothing but the angle between incident ray and the emergent ray. So, we need to calculate it also with the help of protractor. With the help of protractor. So, here we found the angle of deviation as 45 degrees. Angle of deviation as 45 degrees. 45 degrees. So this completes the process.